twin sister Kelly Deal and new drummer Jim McPherson. Now, Kim is finishing up a, a visual aid to understand the breeders and where they come oh, from. Oh, I should put this. I'll put Ultra Vivid Scene first. Okay. This is Josephine Wiggs, your English member. All right. Who was in Perfect Disaster, toured with Ultra Vivid Scene, and was a member of Honey Tongue. Right, uh, yeah. Actually, it's just her and a drummer, the drummer from Spiritualize. Oh, Baseball okay. Spirit. That'll do. <laughs> There's no short in that one, is there? <laughs> You and Dan Quayle should get together. <laughs> okay, so take us through the family tree. Who else we've got? Well, let's see. Um, Jim, the drummer, he used to be in a band in Rage, called Raging Mantras from Dayton. And then the Muses, Sorry Muses, because right. Tanya was in the band. But she is no longer in these bands, and now she's in a band called Belly, right. her band. And um, Pixies, of course. And uh, did we just do the Perfect Disaster? We did that. Yeah, we did we? that. I think we got it covered. Yeah. So Tanya officially left the band. Right. She's now just concentrating on belly. Right. Okay, and and Kelly, you're taking over what Tanya was doing. Right. Yeah. Okay. And we were actually, we did. We were, were in this band before we did anything else because we were in Dayton together. So. Is anyone confused? <laughs> <laughs> I am. Now I guess this is a chance for you to do some more singing than you do in the Pixies, uh, and a chance for you to play guitar. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to do that patch system, the nicotine patch system. Uh huh. Is it is it working? Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, it's, I think it's going to work. And this is as far as giving up your. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay, well let's take a look at uh, the video from your new EP Safari, okay. and this is the title track. Okay. We'll, we'll have more from the Breeders on MTV's 120 Minutes. Safari from the Breeders. Kim, you wrote the song. Can you give us a, a quick tour of your mindset it was when you're like, writing the lyrics? It was like a love hunt, I guess. That would be. A love hunt from the point of view of the hunted or the hunter? I guess the hunter. I didn't actually say that, but it's in the, it's in the bio. It's right. good. I like that's good. Yes. And the video itself, <laughs> the video itself recalls a certain, a classic video, yeah. which is this one. In case anyone didn't notice. What's the video that it's oh, taken a from? Black Sabbath, Paranoid. A classic song that yeah. has influenced a lot of the music coming out today. Yeah, isn't it? It's a great song. It's really punky for that 70s period, mm -hmm. isn't it? Yeah. One of the originals. Good baseline and stuff on it. It's good. Okay, uh, we'll have more of the breeders in the second 60 of MTV's 120 Minutes. And here's a look at that black... <laughs> Welcome back to MTV's 120 Minutes. The Breeders are here. Kim Deal and Kelly Deal, you are most certainly twin sisters. Yeah. And we hear rumors that you used to swap both instruments and boyfriends. Is yeah, that... uh-uh. Just instruments. No, yeah, I guess. Just instruments. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, Kelly, you were uh, originally in The Breeders and the first incarnation, I guess, before right. the release of Pod. Right. Is that correct? Uh -huh. And how did you come back on board? Um, gosh. Why? She just she never wanted to quit her job. Really. Right, yeah. I really liked my job, and I didn't want to quit. I don't know why I did it. Why? I'm broke! <laughs> <laughs> she just quit her job this past summer, so... Okay. But it's fun. It's a lot of fun. Now, the breeders is... She uh, just learned how to play guitar, too. Yeah. Well, that's, that's probably another reason why I didn't join the band. <laughs> we, did, we, did a t we did a short tour in Europe this earlier. It was in June. And I guess you learned... You know, in that safari video, that that's was the a day I learned she learned bar chords. So yeah. there was, I think you can tell too. Good, didn't oh, she? Cool I think study, you can cool tell. Cause yeah. I'm looking weird at the guitar. Well, like, oh uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. Oh, that, oh yeah. We have good videos, don't we? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> um, breeders is a, a, a slang, a homosexual term for heterosexual women. Is that right? Uh, not he just not women. Just uh, it, actually, uh, it was a guy. That was a guy homosexual. Oh, is this any and heterosexual? We were referring to another guy. Oh, he's a breeder. I just thought okay. that was kind of funny. Isn't that weird? You know, like, ew, gross. You yeah. Know? Turning the tables somewhat. Yeah, it's prejudice. funny. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I know at one point you were described as the bangles from hell. And yeah. Jim, do you feel like, like the token male in this band? Do you feel like this is a girl's thing? Um, yeah, I just kind of <laughs> stay. It's just really funny uh, when we, like, left the hotel rooms in Europe. Uh, just They just mobbed. Kim and Kelly and Josephine, and I just walked right into the bus. <laughs> you want my autograph? And she's like, they're all looking at me. They think I was a bodyguard. No, it's not because you're a guy, though. It's just because you're a nervous. I don't yeah, think well. <laughs> well, you were on a tour of Europe, and you have plans to tour in the States? Yeah, at the end of September, to, uh, like just like two weeks, just practice some new songs, because we're going to record an album. So um, we thought we'd practice the songs live. And when will we see the album? 
Any idea? I don't know. I'm not sure, really. We haven't done it yet, so... Hopefully soon. Okay, well, in the Any meantime... <laughs> <laughs> in the meantime, the first Breeders album, Pod, has been re-released, and we're going to take a look at a video from that. This is Hellbound from the...